Finally a break. After four hours of dealing with the rush, I need this. Some time to myself to de-stress. <sighs> the Devil's Lettuce. What an ironic name. Lucy would hate this stuff, I'm sure of that. <laughs> ah, shit. It went out already. <sighs> Damn. And the lighter's out. <laughs> I do not want to head back inside just for a lighter. Maybe a little bit of magic will be fine, just this once. It's not like I'm using it on a human, right? And it's been a while since I've used any, so... Alright, are any of those feathery little asshats around that might snitch on me? No? Alright. Nothing? Well, I guess they do have better things to worry about other than me. That demon that disappeared only to live as a human in a minimum wage job, unbeknownst to most of those around her. Why does that sound familiar? Was it something that Belle had suggested to me? Hmm. I could use a vacation soon. Maybe a self-care day. I do need to touch up my hair. Hmm? Oh no. One of those bird-brained losers. You just had to be lazy today, huh, Alma? It was just for a moment. Oh, no, 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 don't approach me. Oh, wait. Hmm? Uh, hey there. Have I seen anything suspicious around here? Nope. I mean, other than someone just appearing. You know, there is no need to stare at me like that. Yeah, I figured that wouldn't work. Look, it's my lunch right now. I have about 25 minutes to myself before I have to go back to work. I'm going to be 100% honest right now. I'd much rather it if you'd take your unhappy feathery ass back to those blindingly pristine pearly white gates and pissed off. You can't do that? used a spell near a human. Dude, take a chill pill already. I haven't used my demonic powers on anyone or anything other than this little joint here. Huh? Well, yeah, I might have been near some humans, but not close enough for anyone to see or be harmed. Made it look like I used my lighter, too. Uh-huh. I promise. Look, do you think I'd be sitting here, behind this building right now, if I was doing something nefarious, as you say? Yes. <laughs> Can't trust a demon, huh? Are they listening in or something? Just messing around, huh? Rude. You had me thinking that something was up. So, wanna hit? No? Seriously, one of these days you should try it. 
might help you not be so uptight. <laughs> ah, and there's that look. The one that says, wow, I can't believe I willingly spend my time with this demon. What can I say? My boss is Belial, leader of demons set to destroy and corrupt. Though recently, we haven't been that necessary. So, Belle and I are taking a bit of a break. Why? Well, Belle and I don't do anything to begin with. Honestly, since the Steel Age, we haven't been all that necessary. Though the Industrial Revolution was a fun time for us. Did you know Belle and I ran a fantastic company around that time? Though, of course, I had to pretend to be nothing more than the secretary. What's that? awful labor laws during that time. Well, I'd like to just point out that we had nothing to do with that. We had no influence in their politics at that time. Or now. Well, I mean, other than this stuff. <laughs> the devil's lettuce. Jazz grass. <laughs> Though we had it legalized in this state in the human's legal ways. Hmm, petitions and voting. My job is so boring. So fucking boring, and I am not talking about selling this shit. It helps people at least with certain conditions and when not misused. So I really don't understand the negativity surrounding it. Did I ever tell you the story as to why it was actually made illegal? Capitalism. A man who had lumber companies and sold it to paper manufacturers was actually losing money because of hemp. Before then, it was sold as medicine. I mean, so were some other things as well that were actually harmful. Okay, okay, I will admit that it wasn't used properly back then, but it does actually help people now. Of course, studies should always be done. Anyways, I went a bit off topic there. Humankind destroys something that grew out of the earth, something created by the big guy up there. And that's what I'm trying to say. Hmm? Have I just been rambling? <laughs> The reason Belle and I are on a vacation is because humans kind of do our job for us. And we can just take the credit for it. Besides, it's not like you're doing your job. I mean, shouldn't you be sending me back down to H-E double hockey sticks? <laughs> What, me making fun of you feather brains who avoid cursing? Never. <laughs> well, that's the thing. When we first met, I honestly thought you would label me yet another high demon and just send me back down there and I'd just crawl out like usual. But you sat down on the bench next to me and just shared my lunch break with me gave me a chance. I've always wondered why. When was this? You're joking, right? Industrial Revolution? Ring a bell? There was a reason why I brought it up earlier, you know. What? Does all of time just blend together for you? What am I talking about? 
I've forgotten many things most would consider important. Early history, mostly. Anyways, why did you talk to me back then? One of the children. Hmm? No, I don't remember much about that day. Especially anything about the children around that factory. What? Were demons? Of course they were there. We didn't give them the dangerous jobs, though. Besides, they needed the work. Sometimes they didn't exactly have parents to pay for things. Hmm? That's exactly what you mean. What? We showed a small amount of kindness to some tiny humans who were honestly just really down on their luck because of truly awful people? Giving one of the children part of my lunch. Oh. You saw that. I see. So then what? You didn't do anything because I gave some child some food? Hmm. Seems like you feather brains have a bit of a soft heart. <laughs> As do I. No clue what you're talking about. Giving a child food does not mean that I have a soft spot for humans. Not in the slightest. Then why assist them? I... I'm not. I don't think. I gave the children food so that they had energy to work. It was to benefit my boss. Helping them with medication. Some would say the opposite. But I believe I'm doing something good. Again, that might be what you see. What if I am in it all for the wrong reasons? You just simply don't see it that way? <laughs> right, I think my break is over. Hmm. What? We should spend my lunch together more often. Hmm. Well, I am off work tomorrow. But I do know a lovely little Italian restaurant just down the street. That's the one. How about we meet up there around one? Sure. Good. Just a warning, I will show up fashionably late. We're not exactly known for our punctuality. 